Hello everyone, welcome to our Tai Chi Broadsaw class. Today we will learn one movement, it's called Liao Dao. So Liao Dao in the martial art is for the cutting the opponent. So when we learn the Liao Dao, it's very good to improve our shoulders flexibility and also our arms power, to increase our arms power. So, okay, so now let me demonstration this movement first. So this one, the right foot have to stand forward and then backward, up, go backward, forward, backward, forward. So you can see my, I'm using the broad sword to form a figure eight. All right, okay, so now I'll do this direction back, forward, backward, forward. Go to the, my left side, for, then forward, my right side back, and then forward. All right, so this one uh, in the broad sword, we call Liao Dao. Uh, this is called Liao. Uh, so when we use the Liao Dao, we use the, the um, broad sword blades and the, the point, the points of broad sword uh, this this part to to use the power use the power so during we practice we need to relaxing our arm all right so this is very good to improve our shoulders uh, flexibility and uh, increase more your uh, arms power all right so now let's uh, start to learn we let the left toes pointing to 45 degree and right leg just a step forward so your feet are the same as your shoulders width so between has some uh, distance all right so first is holding holding the the broad sword and then relax uh, relax the wrist and let the and let the uh, broad sword drop down uh, to drop down so from here holding and one relax to drop down and then number two, number two, rotate the broadsword to let the uh, broadsword blade facing up. Huh, so this is one, drop down, two, rotate, uh, three, move up and then back, move up and back, three, move forward up, and then move to the left side, down. Uh, and then forward. So again, one, two. Uh, so when you two, you I rotate my arm and relax my elbow. So holding the sword, uh, and then three, go up, and then draw the circle, draw the circle, and go down, and then forward. All right. So this is the on the. Uh, on my left, my my front, on uh, my in front, to make the circle. Okay, so one, two, three. Okay, so now go to the to the back side. So now continue to go up and turn right. My bra so go backward and go down and then go forward. Uh, so it's the my right part of my go to my back circle and then forward to my left up go backward and forward backward uh, let me show you in another direction uh, prepare one two uh, three four back so then you will continue to circle in front and circle backwards and then in front. Uh, so you can, you can practice. Uh, when you practice more, you can do it a little bit faster. Okay, so when you, when you practice, we need to also need to turn in our body. You can see the body practice. One, two. 
Uh, three lift up. My body will a little bit turn to the left, and then pointing to this direction, and then turn right, face forward. And then when I go back, my body also need to turn a little bit more, right 45, right 45, go backward, and then forward, backward, forward. All right, so this is the uh, called Liao Dao. Uh, you also can uh, use the left side because of it's better you know the right hand and at the same time you learn the left hand. Although in the broad sword form, we use the right hand often because we uh, right hand's weapon, left hand is palm. But uh, if you want to improve more this part, uh, flexibility and power, you also can do this uh, to practice uh, left hand. Uh, then one is drop down, two, two is rotate, uh, three is move to front, uh, and then forward, and then here you turn to the left, let the brosso go backward and forward uh, to draw the uh, figure eight. Uh, you can put your palm uh, just in front of your chest uh, or you're close to your shoulder to practice. Uh, so I suggest you um, sometime uh, when you practice by yourself, uh, you can practice this movement uh, for uh, five minutes to one side and five minutes another side uh, to improve the shoulders uh, mobility and to let your arm become stronger and to learn how to holding your broadsword in a flexible way. So you can see when you do, you have to do, uh, you can, if you want to fast, you can fast. Uh, you just uh, keep your weight more in front. Uh, you don't need to shift too much. When you go backward, you can a little bit shift front, you shift away front. Uh, backward, you a little bit shift back, forward, back, forward. Uh, so the more you practice, the movement you will feel is more flow. Then it's more flow, you can do a little bit faster. All right, so this is the, our Liao Dao.